Introduction High metabolic rates require large amounts of fuel. A digestive system needs to be as light as possible and effective. Although for birds, they need to keep low body weight. Thus, little fat storage need to locate. They need to ingest and digest food as quickly and efficiently as possible. Birds can be carnivores, herbivores, and omnivores. Digestion is completed by the action of various enzymes secreted by different organs and accessory gland of the digestive system. This system is responsible for the breakdown of complex, non absorbable components like carbohydrate, proteins, and fats. Major components of avian digestive system Oral cavity Esophagus Crop Stomach Small intestine Large intestine and Cloaca Avians do not have teeth The breakdown of ingested food done by Beak Muscular gizzard Library plan. Esophagus divide into precorp and postcorp. It cooperatively larger than mammals to accommodate the swallowing of large unchewed food items. Abundant mucus gland can be found and it provide lubrication for the food being swallowed. Within the neck, the esophagus feature a distensible dilation called the crop, while empty, the crop of birds contract once per minute. But if the food is present in the perventriculus, then there is a complete inhibition of this contractile activity and the food remains within. Proventricular serves as granular stomach which is located between the post or esophagus and gizzard. In secret hydrochloric acid, pepsinogen and mucus. So will continue into the gizzard where protolysis occurs. The gizzard is the muscular stomach that is made up of two strong muscles to provide muscular force to grind and crush food stuff. The presence of grit aided the process of digestion. Gizzard performed 2 to 5 contractions per minute. Pancreas is located between the duodenal loop and sacred pancreatic juice which aid digestive of starch, fat and protein. It also helps to neutralize the acid condition of proventriculus. Liver consists of gallbladder that secrete bile juice which bile involved in fat digestion neutralize the acid condition small intestines made up of the duodenum and lower small intestine digestion of food occurs in the duodenum absorption of nutrients mainly in the lower intestine duodenum receives digestive juice from the pancreas and bile from the liver consists of metal diverticulum which assumes an immune function after retraction of the yolk sac before hatching. Sika is a pair of structure which is located at the junction of small and large intestine. It is functioned to reabsorb water. It is also functioned to for microbial digestion of cellulose. It contains a small amount of carbohydrate and protein digestion. The fermentation of the remaining course of material also is a function of Sika. In the large intestine, water reabsorption occurs in order to increase the water content in the body. So in large intestine, it also helps to maintain the water balance in the body. Cloaca, site that is common to the digestive, reproductive and urinary systems. Three regions, A. Coprodium, B. Eurodium and C. Protodium. The three regions are A. Coprodium, receive excreta from the intestines. B. Eurodium receive fluid from the kidneys through the ureters and material from the oviduct. And C. Protodium stores the excreta and open externally into the muscularis anus or vent. Still in cloaca, lying on the dorsal wall of the eurodium is the bursa of Fabricius, a lymphoid organ important in newly hatched birds. Moving on to clinical correlation. Bear with me, stay focused. Proventricular dilatation disease, common affecting macaws. The illness affects the nerves of the digestive tract, which means that the stomach stretches and normal muscle contractions don't take place. Symptoms chronic weight loss, dropping containing undigested food. 
can be spread through exposure to the droppings of an infected bird. Quarantine is essential. Disinfecting their living area is also very important. Treatment, antiviral drugs, anti-inflammatory and mutinized. Oral canker Affecting pigeons and is caused by a tiny parasite called trichomonas. This parasite is often spread through contaminated drinking water. The parasite causes a yellow button of pus to form in bird's mouth. Symptoms Weight loss Birds picking up food then dropping it, cheese-like plug in your bird's mouth, reluctant to eat. Treatment Anti-parasitic medication Prevention Change drinking water daily Avoid sharing of water with wild birds. Roundworms can be caught from wild birds whose droppings fall into the enclosure. Symptoms, loss of condition, weakness, loss of weight and death usually due to obstructed intestine. Treatment and prevention, deworm, usually on a three-month shadow. Tape worms, found in cockatoos, African greys and in finches. They transfer between birds when an intermediate host, spider, slugs, bugs, Great bite, the bird pick it up from the droppings from another infected bird. Symptoms that are visible but sometimes the tapeworms can be seen moving in the droppings of an infected bird. Treatment and prevention, deworm, usually on a three-month shadow. Candidiasis, thrush, caused by Candida albicans, affecting low immunodeficiency birds, but suffering from malnutrition and other illnesses can develop thrush for the same reason. It occurs in stomach, intestine, and crop. Also affects skin and central nervous system. Severity depends on age and immune system. Symptoms, regurgitation of food and lack of appetite, swelling of crop, and filled with mucus. Prevention, cleaning and disinfecting of cage, feed, and drinking container. Treatment, medication. Avian gastric yeast. Gastric yeast lives in the digestive tracts of birds with weakened immune system. Symptoms: chronic weight loss, regurgitation of food with excessive eating, and loss of appetite. This condition can vary in severity with death depending on species and strain of yeast. Relapses may occur, and they can also have the organism in their droppings. So quarantine and disinfection of environment is essential. Treatment Immune Booster Thank you! <laughs>